The first people's recreation site along the Blanchichez Road in Arima now has a water supply after a booster station was installed by the Water and Sewage Authority, WASA. Member of Parliament for Arima, Planning and Development Minister Penelope Beckles says the commissioning of the First People's Booster Station is a significant milestone event which brings together a mutual dream on the part of the government, the national community at large and the indigenous community. It has long been a dream of the indigenous people is to establish on this land a traditional village and a living museum as well as to undertake the cultivation of traditional plants. Um, this commissioning today will go a long way in ensuring that that dream materializes. Minister of Public Utilities Marvin Gonzalez notes this is the 33rd successfully completed project under the Community Water Improvement Program in almost two years. Minister Gonzalez boasts that now over 100,000 citizens all across Trinidad and Tobago are experiencing an improved water supply. Trinidad and Tobago, based on the statistics of the Water and Sewage Authority, only 34% of the population enjoyed 24-7 uh, water supply. And because of some of the little interventions we've made under this program, at this point in time as we speak, just above 51% of the population now enjoys a 24-7 level of service. Chief of the Santa Rosa First Peoples Community, Ricardo Barrett Hernandez, expressed appreciation and gratitude for the support given to the First Peoples Community.